CTV News, Vancouver Island Report. Good evening. Vancouver Island is melting under what could become record-breaking heat. Temperatures soared above the 30-degree mark across the mid-island today, and more hot days are in the forecast. In the Alberni Valley, the air is heavy with heat, but the mood is light, as locals and visitors enjoy the late arrival of summer. CTV's Jet Bassey joins us from Port Alberni with more. Jet? Well, Andrew, Port Alberni right now, it's boiling. The temperature is supposed to hit around 31. But let me tell you this, it doesn't feel like 31. It feels more like 35, 40, maybe, maybe even 45. But it's not deterring people from coming outdoors. A lot of people are on the water. They're boating. They're going to water parks. Especially the kids are enjoying the last few days of summer because school is starting just around the corner. The sun is beating down on Port Alberni, breaking the 32 degrees barrier. It's one of the hottest days of the year for the region, a surprise to many. Beautiful weather so late in the summer, but they'll take it. It's been a long time coming for the, for the good weather. We had a pretty poor spring and uh, we're lavishing in tropical weather now. And that attracts people. The local visitor center is flocked with tourists, people looking to explore the valley all thanks to the sun. Our numbers uh, that uh, we have at the visitor center here and statistics wise proves that as soon as the sun comes out people move and they go do outdoor activities and camp and have a whale of a time but it has to be good weather to do that. In a local water park kids try to keep cool beating the heat and having a laugh. You just keep them busy until school starts again and just enjoy this beautiful weather while it lasts and yeah it's great it's been a great summer. The coolest drink in town is a froster. The ice cold drink is keeping the register ringing. About every five, ten minutes, I'm selling two, three, up to five frosters at a time. In Parksville, ice cream is the cool treat. Everyone buys ice cream all day, all the time, even when it's not hot out. <laughs> the sun is bringing carloads of people to the Parksville Beach Festival. They hit the water park, the beach, they fly kites, and are amazed by the famous Parksville sand castles. With the sun, they expect a record number through their gates. We'll get hot. We're right beside the ocean, so it's a wonderful place to be to cool off. You can see the flags blowing in the breeze. We're going to have a lot of people down here this afternoon, this hot day. Like other golf courses on the Mid Island, the great weather is bringing out the golfers in Nanaimo. They're in a cheerful mood, even if they bogey a hole. It took a while for the sun to start shining this year for us, but uh, it's beautiful now, and, and the, the course is playing just exceptional. After a miserable spring, the club says it's time the sun came out. Hopefully, it will stay a little longer and help with business. We really appreciate the sunshine showing up late, but uh, it is here, and that we see a big impact on our business for sure. People come out and enjoy the afternoon. It's sunny till late in the evening. No matter where you were today, the weather was great. People were out in the sun, hovering around the water to stay cool, enjoying the best of what Vancouver Island has to offer. This tropical heat will continue for the next few days here in Port Alberni. Tomorrow it's supposed to hit around 33 degrees, but again, it will feel warmer, so you will have to protect yourself. Make sure you wear a hat, sunblock, sunglasses, and keep a water bottle beside you at all times. And make sure you protect the young ones from the sun. Bring them into the shade after every 15 minutes, and it'll help them cool down. So bring the kids out, enjoy the sunshine, and enjoy what Vancouver Island has to offer, because school is only a few weeks away. It is. Good Andrew? plan. Thanks, Chet.